Okay, so one of the ninjas has sent in this. Uh, how can I connect with people I meet day to day? Do you recommend business cards? Now, I used to love business cards. I used, uh, I read an amazing book by Alan Pease, Questions Are the Answers. Now, if you haven't read that book already, I highly, highly, highly recommend you read it. It's fantastic. I might put a link in the comments below to it, or I might just name the book below. Uh, I won't make any affiliate, affiliate commissions or anything like that from it. I just highly recommend you read it. It's one of those books that you can read. If you're a leader especially, you can read that book and you can train your team just from what's inside that book it's amazing right but what he said in the book is he kind of mapped out a, a business card and my business card was and I'm an, I was introverted I'm still introverted but when I was building my business in the early days I was like I was really scared to speak to people okay especially on the street uh, like you know everyday life and that's what we're usually told so are uh, you run out of people oh I've run out of people to talk to what am I gonna do call my upline oh mr. upline mrs. upline what am I gonna do I've run out of people to talk to I don't know what to do uh, well, there's millions of people outside. What city do you live in? Liverpool. Oh, well, there's three million people in Liverpool, or whatever the population is, I don't really know. There's three million people in Liverpool, just go to the streets and stop people and strangers and speak to them. And I'm like, I'm not doing that. Now, if you can do that, if, you're, if you've, you're, you kind of feel like you can do that, great. But the business, the business card I had was, it was a thumbnail of me, which if you have a business card, make sure it has your personal profile photo on there. Make sure it has your name, your telephone number, and a link to your your um, your Facebook profile. Okay, so then you're sending traffic to your Facebook profile. I don't recommend links because if you put www.mycompanyx.com forward slash Fraser, people just Google what is Company X and they find the answers. Simple. Don't do that. But on the other side, there was what would you want? What do you want? And there was a number. Of, there was a list of things. Create a legacy, build a secondary income, time freedom, fire your boss, retire early retirement. There was about eight different things that Alan Pease covers in his book. And it was very easy because the, the business card turned into a prospecting card. So you could speak to people in the street, you could speak to um, waiters, and you could be like, hey, do any of those, three, uh, any of those eight things interest you? Extra income? Yeah, extra income's cool. Great. Call that number, call, call me or connect me on Facebook and I can chat with you some more. Because the majority of people, when they speak to people in the streets and the strangers, they try and pitch them there and then. Who is going? Who's honestly going to join a business when they've got a cart full of avocados, right? Yeah, if you're watching this, you might think, I did, right? But that's going to be one in many, 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 many thousands. It just doesn't happen, but it's lead generation. So here's what I do now. I don't have business cards. I know I've just covered a little bit about business cards, the basics. All you want to do is literally, you can do it when you're shopping. When you're shopping, you have your phone out, right? You're in the queue, you've got it all ready, and then someone will basically go, and the cashier will say, that'll be £13.50. You say, how long have you worked here for? Or whilst they're tossing it all up, how, how long have you worked here for? Oh, it's been about five, five years now. Cool, can you see yourself doing this for the rest of your life? Just curious. Uh, no, probably not. Well, great. I, I can help. I can help with that. That's what I do for a living. That's why I'm able to shop uh, on a Monday afternoon. What, what's your name? Do you have a Facebook account? Yeah, I do. It's Bob Jones. Oh, great. Let me. Is it? Are you? Are you this one? Right, Bob. I, mean, I can just type it in on Bob. Bob Jones just to find someone. Are you? Are you this one? The top. Yeah, yeah. That's me. The top one. Okay, great. I just. I've just sent you a, a friend request. Send me a message once you're finished, and I can send you some some more information. That's it. You could go and do three shops a day if you wanted to, if you figured out it worked. Again, waiters, you can do the same thing. Air, air stewardess, air hostesses. There's so many situations you can be in where you can do that, where all you're doing is saying, how long have you been doing this for? Can you see yourself doing this for the rest of your life? Right? Um, hey, is this, what's your name? Bob Jones. Is that it? Top one? Bang. Add them and I'll send you a message. If they don't reply, they see the message and they don't reply, don't worry about it. Just remove the friend request. <laughs> if they do reply, great. You go through the process, you communicate with them, and eventually you can close them. Top, that's, that's a real good way of being able to build your business offline by getting people offline, online. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like this sort of content, feel free to hit that subscribe button, like this video, give me a comment, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Um, feel free also to connect with me over on Instagram and Facebook. And in the meantime, go ahead and watch those two recommended videos I've got for you there. And see you soon.